Right, um, welcome to the launch strategy for digital platforms develop and launch. My name is Osita Dima Ogu. We're going to be talking about Niger Players Abroad, which is my project. And Niger Players Abroad is not about spotlighting activities of top players of Nigerian origin. Applying that trade uh, in top five leagues of Europe. I want to talk about the top five leagues. I'm talking about the English Premier League, the Spanish La Liga, the Italian Serie A, the uh, uh, German Bundesliga, and the French League. Oh. So Nigeria boasts of a passionate fan base, a rich history of talented players. In fact, Nigeria is known to be one of the uh, biggest exporters of players to European leagues. And uh, some of these players are there uh, without some of our people knowing more about them. Um, but um, this is something that also fuels national pride in us because uh, it leads to a large fan base of followership from Nigerians at home to the European clubs. So uh, this, for this reason, a niche was identified, a gap was identified, uh, Nigerian players abroad is determined to bridge that particular gap, uh, the gap uh, between fans at home, fans in Nigeria, knowing more about these players overseas, these players in the top league, knowing more about the ones that are playing, the ones that are on bench, the ones that are injured, and the likes. So, so uh, this particular project, this particular platform, uh, was not formulated in isolation. Uh, enough research was done towards knowing if this was needed. Uh, my survey was centered, my research or survey was centered in Abuja, the further capital territory of Nigeria, and it showed a huge demand for a website like Nigeria uh, Players uh, Brought, uh, the fans want more, they want more than just a discourse of each game uh, these players play in. They want to know uh, more uh, on, uh, about the social media lifestyle. They want to know more about transfer. They want to hear expert analysis about these players from you know, football experts, uh, sport journalists and the likes. And they want information that they can use daily. And from this explanation, we should say Niger Players Abroad is a winner already. What are the marketing strategies, what are the PR strategies that we're going to be employing, and uh, players abroad will be employing to help uh, the platform thrive? Uh, one, we say content is key, and we will be focusing on consistent coverage of these top five leagues, consistent coverage of these top five leagues with content, content that uh, our visitors will always want to read more, want, want to, you know, uh, uh, want to subscribe to, want to satisfy these uh, uh, visitors with rich content, rich ones, uh, as the case may be. Then the social media strategy will be utilization of uh, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Thread. And just name it, every other social media platform that can push the traffic to our website. Search engine optimization strategy is not one that we want to toy with if you are a web designer, if, you're aware, if, you have, if you've got a site, and we'll be using optimally uh, that particular procedure towards enabling visitors to get, you know, the, uh, the, to get, you know, pushed to our site, to, to get redirected to our site when they search for anything pertaining Nigerian players in Europe. Then brand strategy, we will definitely develop a strong uh, brand identity uh, that will retain our audience, that will keep them glued. Identity that we want to make them say, yes, this is our own, and this is where we can get our news pertaining to Nigerian players abroad. Monetization strategy, uh, for now starting up, uh, we're gonna be finding, uh, looking for a way whereby in the next few months, we'll be able to explore advertising from top brands, from top uh, corporate bodies, and also partnerships from uh, uh, relevant stakeholders in the sporting sector in Nigeria. The target audience are primarily young men between the age, young men and women uh, uh, between the age of 25 to 45, who follow these uh, European, these, uh, European uh, leagues 
online. Uh, we follow these Nigerian stars in these European leagues online. They are going to be our target audience. But our primary, our secondary target audience uh, will be journalists, sport journalists also that want to uh, use the opportunity of being ahead of them to get news from us to syndicate news from us and also the fantasy football players uh, that want to use us as a way of getting information regarding the purchase of players from one club to another. When we talk about fantasy football players, we're talking about uh, these virtual football managers uh, that just uh, in recent years spot up. Uh, it is a way whereby people, uh, before the beginning of a season, they uh, like uh, football managers, but virtually they buy players from one club to another that helps them to win the league. Uh, it, it is played between, uh, in most cases, between uh, uh, 18 to 20 people per league. And this will surely help them in achieving their aim of knowing more about the players. And that is what one service we are about to render. The user experience, you can't talk about a website without having a very good user experience. And the site will be easy to navigate either on desktop, uh, on, on, the, on a, a laptop or a desktop, or even on a mobile device on smartphones, uh, because it will be well structured and clear. So our visitors will have a very good user experience. And if you notice, we'll be using the green, white, green colors of Nigeria so far. That is one of the uh, columns uh, of the website. Then there is definitely going to be the optimization of search engines to ensure visitors can easily find us, uh, uh, as the case may be. It's the the uh, search engine of optimization will easily direct them to a Nigeria Players Abroad website. Content will be written articles, news articles regarding this, uh, anything story, any story that will pertain to the players will be in news articles. Then we are going to be having images. Images uh, will be, you know, all the time updated. Images from their lifestyle of the pitch and on the pitch, and it will be updated every now and then. And we are going to be having a video analysis as uh, aspect where experts, sports experts, as football experts, sports journalists, we brainstorm, we discuss about the play, uh, how these players were able to uh, play in the week Past and also the ones that didn't play, and also what we expect from them, and talk about their forms. You know, everything about expert analysis we uh, will be embedding in this particular uh, piece of content. Then below is the uh, website proper uh, using the uh, Adobe portfolio. What are our commercial opportunities? Uh, we'll be utilizing what I call AdGos. AdGos is attract, generate, offer, and sell. Attract visitors with high quality content about Nigerian players in Europe, generate revenue through website traffic. Uh, we're going to be using Google AdSense advertising, partnership with betting companies, and not forgetting they must be responsible gambling promotion. We're not going to be, uh, because we're going to be having young people here, and uh, we don't want to promote irresponsible uh, gambling. Then offer, we're going to be offering our subscribers exclusive content content that we give them value for money because they are valued uh, subscribers. Then sell, uh, we're going to be selling team merchandise like jerseys uh, to, to, to enable us, you know, uh, get, uh, get income, uh, get revenue uh, in terms of fortifying, in terms of helping us grow as a brand. And of course, this is the arrangement of, uh, of the uh, submission of the assessment uh, in if we have the launch strategy, which is this particular material. Uh, we have the website here, which goes directly to uh, show us the home page. We have the first content, which is going to be talking about the news article. We have the content number two, which is going to be giving us uh, the particular uh, story, stories that speaks for themselves. And we have the content three, which is the video uh, podcast, where yours sincerely is going to be interviewing two other sport analysts uh, that will be discussing about the week past week, uh, past week and our players were able to, you know, play, uh, play uh, the players' activities and uh, they were able to navigate uh, the past week in, in, in talking about the uh, top five legs as a whole. And that's uh, all I have as regards the launch strategy. I hope this has been able to give a clear understanding of what Niger players abroad has got to offer. Thank you.